Hey guys, welcome back to Pretty Uncensored. I am continuing on with the Glam Home Makeover on a Budget, and this is the bathroom series. If you haven't already checked out my other videos, I have a few of them up, so go have a look at those. So for this one, I redid my whole bathroom for under $150 and in a weekend. I am going to talk about all of the things I did, where I purchased everything, um, kind of all the details. So if you're interested in any of the products I purchased, they are in the description box below. And I hope this gives you guys some ideas and inspirations to do in your own homes. So as you can see, the bathroom looked very dated. It was really dark. It was very stock. Um, it just, it had no personality and I hated it. So I redid the flooring. I redid the lighting. I painted out the cabinets. I put new countertops and I put all fresh new accents and accessories. Um, the look I was looking for was to take it from drab and dreary to a clean, glam, and modern, updated bathroom. Uh, I think I really achieved that. So this view here is in the exact position the after picture will be. So when you get to the next picture, you are about to see the most dramatic, amazing transformation that $150 could get you. So like I said, the transformation is absolutely unbelievable. I am so happy with the way it turned out. It was a little bit of hard work. I kind of used um, leftover paint, flooring, and um, hardware from other projects in my house, but I still included the price of those items in the overall budget. I am going to break down everything later on in this video. So let's get into the details. So here is what I like to call the stock um, lighting. A lot of new homes for a younger audience are going to have lights like this. So if you are a little nervous about replacing it, it actually was super easy. It was just a couple screws and a couple wires. I did it with my friend in about 15 minutes and I should have done this years ago. So here is the after and like I said, I wanted full glam, full tacky, full glitter and sparkle and that is exactly what I got. I purchased this light from Costco, the Costco website. It was under $75 I believe. I am absolutely in love with it. There is no more perfect light that I could ever find. Um, so I'm super happy with that purchase. And behind it, I applied um, a silver foil wallpaper. I just wanted something to bounce the light off of. And like I said, that glam tacky look I was going for. Here is a close-up of the marble vinyl adhesive that I applied to the countertops. Um, I didn't obviously have the budget to get new countertops, but for $15, this was an absolute steal. I'm so happy with how it turned out. And as you can see, the backsplash I painted with leftover General Finishes Milk Paint in the color Driftwood. So I just painted right on the ceramic tile and then I put a polyurethane coat in satin finish on top. I then painted the cabinets, which you will see in the next clip, but here I am showing you the gem um, handle pulls that I purchased off of Amazon. It was 25 in a pack and it was under $20. They just add that little playful glam and here is a picture of the cabinets that I painted with the general finishes milk paint 
in driftwood so this is the best paint ever because all you do is wash these surfaces with TSP and let dry then there's no sanding there's no priming you just paint right on top of the wood and I only needed to do one coat of this so it cost under $35 for the quart and then on top of that you put a polyurethane finish and I chose the satin finish I will link the paint I purchased off Amazon in the description box below if you're interested in looking into that I took down the mirror that came with the house um, it was just like I say the stock type of mirror and I used this mirror I had left over from before and so I painted it with the general finishes milk paint in snow white and i just think taking down that other mirror and having this one up that has a nice thick border just makes it look more of an upgrade more expensive it um it just really brought the bathroom together Here's a few of my favorite little accents and decor items I picked up. So I just bought a clean, clear and white um, tumbler and toothbrush holder and hand soap from Walmart. And I believe they're about two bucks each. And then I put them on top of a cake stand that I got off of Amazon. I think that's a really cute little um, decor thing that I do kind of in every room in my house where, where there's hand soap it just you know gives you that little bit of upgrade and I think it just keeps everything nice and clean and organized I grabbed a basket from the dollar store and then I put some new fluffy gray um, towels I think that in any bathroom if you have really nice hand towels out it just looks more presentable and luxurious so that's what I did there I purchased these shower hooks from Walmart I believe and they were super cheap and then I bought a $15 shower curtain I just wanted clean and white and um, sparkly that's all I wanted this bathroom to be so that was a really good find I picked up some candles and some a candle tray a sparkly candle tray from our dollar store I think candles in any bathroom create a really nice ambiance and the scent obviously helps I picked up this mirror at our local bargain store for ten dollars I really like to add mirrors in bathrooms and small spaces it just obviously opens it up and makes it look bigger and then to finish off the space we laid down some new vinyl laminate waterproof flooring it made a world of difference and it was super easy to install it was a little more difficult around the toilet area um, and then just kind of a nice little rug as you walk in and that kind of wraps everything up I hope this video gave you some ideas of inspiration and you use them in your own home check out Pinterest um, check out the Amazon websites, Zoo Lily, Bed Bath & Beyond, Walmart, your local dollar store. Um, just keep digging and you will find really affordable options. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching.